the precision test equipment need was there, clearly demonstrated by all the MSOs. The cable industry really lacked excellent equipment to perform measurements at doxes. Their own equipment really lacked the ability to do burst measurements, and hence the idea started forging together as much as five or six years ago, but really came to fruition with the creation of DOCSIS 3.0 that perhaps the ideal test equipment would be the CMTS itself. The RX48 has 5 dB more dynamic range than the cable TV analyzer that the industry relies on. To that end, we're not only able to accurately assess how well or how poor the network is doing, but we can actually do a variety of measurements in burst or constant carrier mode that the industry were previously incapable of delivering. The RX48 will allow the MSO to make actual DOCSIS burst measurements and to the point that we can even specify what mini slot do you want to look at on the DOCSIS burst for the power and the signal quality. That characteristic alone is not possible on any other chip but the RX48. With new technology, the capability for triggered fast Fourier transform measurements, we can actually tell the MSO how large the ingress noise is, how bad the impulse is, how well the ingress canceler is doing because we can show them an FFT before and after the ingress canceler. And the most important of all, we can tell them how linear their network is because we do 102 megahertz FFT bandwidth signal that allows us to look at all the harmonics generated from the laser or the optical receiver. 